Hey guys, this is Nathan here and today I'm gonna teach you how to uh, get the values, some values of uh, sin theta, cos theta and tan theta using the very easy table law method. Um, so let's get started. So first for doing this, uh, you need to have a 6 into 5 table. I already tried it, so you're gonna open and just Okay, so here I have the 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and a 5 uh, table. So let's. Um, okay, now let's work. Uh, so, first, um, we're gonna just leave this left side space and we're gonna start with the first right, that is the second, uh, second right from the left. And uh, so now you're gonna put some values. That is, okay, let's make a light theta thicker. Okay, so first write some values here. Put zero here, zero, and one by four here, and one by two here, three by four, and one. Okay, uh, so in the next, uh, you're gonna put some values. Um, so I would like to put 0, uh, 30, 45, and 60, 90. Okay, so now let's get started with sine theta, cos theta, and tan theta. Um, so you're gonna write sine theta here and cos theta here and you're gonna put tan theta here. This is pretty easy. Don't worry at the starting. You get roots. They, man, they'll just afraid you. This is not uh, tough. So let's get started. Um, I'm gonna choose this color. So first what you're gonna do is just uh, um, uh, root this, uh, root this number and put the value here. So root of 0 is nothing but 0 and uh, root of 1 by 4 is nothing but 1 by root 4 that is equal to 2 and you're gonna put a root of 1 by 2 that is equal to 1 by root 2. Anyway the value of root 1 is 1 so I've just put 1 here and for this here you're gonna have root 3 by uh, 2 I guess yeah it's 2 and uh, here you're gonna have root 1 as 1 so uh, for the cos theta you're just gonna put this uh, absolutely in reverse order that is 1 here and uh, root 3 by 2 that is this thing here this thing here this thing here this thing here and this thing here so you're gonna put root 3 by 2 and 1 by root 2 and 1 by 2 and uh, 0 here so for uh, tan theta what you're gonna do is just uh, divide the sine theta by cos theta so when you divide uh, 0 by 1 you ultimately get the result as 0 and when you divide 1 by 2 into root 3 by 2 you get a 1 by 2 into um, that is a C when you get 1 by 2 into uh, 2 by root 3 2 2 gets cancelled and you get 1 by root 3 and uh, next you're gonna put uh, uh, divide uh, 1 by root 2 and 1 by root 2 here you're gonna get, um, what are you gonna get? This is, uh, okay, this, uh, the value is 1 as root 2 and root 2 gets cancelled. When root 2 just goes up, uh, it gets cancelled. And next you're gonna multiply root 3 by 2 and uh, 2 into 1. That is, you get uh, 2 and 2 cancelled and you get uh, 3. Come in, uh, just got a visitor, just pass it. You know, 
okay and so uh, now you're gonna do the last step that is divide 1 by 0 and you get the result as infinity that's it so you got uh, some values of sine 30 is 1 by 2 sine 45 is 1 by root 2 and so, so on I hope this is informative to you please uh, do like it like L I E. Okay, thanks for watching this viewers. Thank you. Goodbye.